Baby, hot girl summer is right around the corner. Are you ready? What's up you guys? Welcome back to my channel. My name's Nolani. We bring everything beauty here brought to you by the queen herself. And if you're joining us again, my love, how are you? It's so good to see you. You worried about everything going on in the world? Me too. Me too. I understand that. But I'm gonna spread some positivity today. We're gonna get some positivity out. We're gonna go ahead and get this looks. We're gonna go ahead and get this look out for Hot Girl Summer. You know what I'm saying? It's here, love. It's on its way. I'm just trying to make sure you ready. Okay. Now, as you can see, this look is glowing. So I know y'all need that info. Like, let's get into it. Let's go. I'm going to start off by laying my brows down with this brow freeze by Anastasia Beverly Hills. She do give that lay. I can't lie. And you know, everybody's on that little natural brow kick. So it is a look. First, I'm just gonna use this beauty oil. And this stuff gives me luxury, boo. And it's just so, just the way it melts into the skin. Ooh, yes, ma'am. So, this isn't really a necessary step, but I have eczema, so my skin be dry. And this just makes sure we're looking extra glowy once we apply the makeup. So, I definitely recommend it. All right, so next we're gonna prime. I'm using the Milk Hydro Grip Primer. My fave, everybody's fave. Now you don't have to wear a foundation. You know, you could just go all natural skin, just do some concealer if you'd like. But I do have some discoloration, some spots, hyperpigmentation. So I'm gonna cover that with a tinted serum. And this is definitely the way to go for summertime, you know, hot girl. One, it gives you that glow easily, and two, it's very lightweight, so you won't be feeling it all day, you know? I'm not trying to have our makeup sweat off this summer, because that ain't hot. And I'm just going to go ahead and blend this out with a beauty blender that I'm spraying with setting spray. As you can see, that tinted moisturizer did a really good job at even the skin tone, so now we can move on. Now I'm just going in and using some concealer just in, just on my under eye because she is dark and to make sure it blends seamlessly I'm also going to blend it out with a ble uh, beauty blender with setting spray. Now to set that concealer, I'm just gonna go in with a tiny bit of loose powder. And now we're not gonna bake this, we're kinda gonna press it in love. Press it in, work it in. Press that in and make sure the concealer is set really well. And brush off any excess. Okay, now we can fill in these brows. Now, usually I do go for the IG brow, you know, this line, top line, conceal, boom, boom, boom. But for the, you know, hot girl summer aspect, we're just gonna go ahead and do a nice feathered brow. So I pinch the tip of my brush and I'm just gonna go ahead and do light feather like strokes to fill in any sparsy areas of the brows. Okay, brows. Now, as usual, I'm just going to go ahead and clean them up with a P. Loy's base. Just so we get that nice clean cut on the bottom. And I am only cleaning up the bottom of the brow. I'm not doing the top as I do usually. No. I am going to use a beauty blender to take the P. Louise base onto the rest of the lid just so it can bring up my dark eyes to the rest of the color of my face. Now it's always best if you're not going to apply eyeshadow over your eye base just because I like this color to set it. I use a pressed powder 
just to go over and set this and make sure it doesn't crease throughout the day. I'm just going to take a dark brown eyeshadow into my crease just to add some dimension because as you can see my eyelid is giving tight flat and we don't really want like flat color you know it's just looking not it so we're going to add a little bit of something just to add some dimension to the lid and I'm really just taking a chocolate color and going right into the lid into the crease and working that in circular motions nothing crazy blending brush now I don't have many powder products on my face so I am gonna go ahead and go in with a powdered bronzer just to add some swoggle you know to the face as for blush we're gonna go ahead and with this cream blush from Fenty Beauty called petal poppin okay that's exactly real cute love that color and honestly I'm just gonna use my finger to apply it now you obviously don't have to wear lashes you can just do a good coating of mascara but we extra out here so I'm obviously gonna wear some lashes little lashes but lashes are right, waiting for the lashes to dry I'm just gonna go ahead in with a nice little highlighter this is a Juvia's Place loose powder highlight and yeah I love it it's a good natural highlight it's like a bronzy I'd say more of a gold gonna use some setting spray this is just max set and refresh so it really is just setting spray with glitter in it yo I just missed my face all of those times now I'm gonna add setting spray without glitter because it's kind of a little bit better but we can always walk out all right now that our lashes is uh, secured we're gonna go ahead and just do some lippy now you don't have to but I like a lip liner this is just a lip oil and we're just gonna apply that <laughs> All right, now I'm gonna use my set my setting spray, and this one don't have glitter, but it still does the job. I'm gonna go ahead and put a wig on, finish this look, and I'll be back to show y'all the finished product, okay? And that's all she wrote. I wish I could have Meg's song playing right now, so for now I'm just gonna sing it. I'm a hot girl, I do hot shit, sweaty shit calm, I'm a big. Anyways, uh, what do you guys think? Are you feeling this look? Are y'all ready for Hot Girl Summer? It's here, baby. That, it's around the corner. It's already Hot Girl Spring. What? Y'all, as usual, thank you so much for tuning in, watching this video. You already know you're the best. Make sure you tune in for next week's video. I hope you have a good rest of your week, love. Have a good day. Take care of yourself. Show yourself some self-love. You know what I'm saying? Because you out here doing it for you. I will catch you in the next one, my love. Thank you for watching and bye-bye.